powerful show of support for an Oakland County Sheriff's deputy killed in the line of duty. Hundreds of law enforcement and so many more packing a church in Auburn Hills to honor the life of Deputy Bradley Reckling. Leaving behind three children and his wife who has a fourth child on the way. As Rod Maloney shows us, law enforcement from across the region came to show their support for the family and the community. Filing in under an American flag hung ceremoniously between two fire truck ladders. Hundreds of police officers from all over Michigan, all over Metro Detroit, Flint, and even as far out state as Branch County near Hillsdale, where they lost a sheriff's deputy yesterday, filled the church. Because Detective Reckling also rode in the Oakland County Sheriff's Motorcycle Motorcade Unit, motorcycle officers from all over the state came in as well in procession. Officers in their honor guard uniforms lined up outside the church as the visitation ended and the sentiment throughout summed up by Clinton Township Police Detective Tom Hill. It's important to come out and show our respect to uh, Brad Reckling and his family in uh, Oakland County Sheriff's Department. Anytime we face a loss in law enforcement, uh, we feel it as an entire loss, law enforcement community. Um, it's a rippling effect. Each one of us, um, you know, has a heavy heart and uh, it's, it's a difficult time right now. Funerals like this, of course, becoming far more common and something Wayne County Sheriff Raphael Washington says is deeply concerning, leading him to want to say to the Reckling family. Don't ever let anyone say, uh, well, you know, this happens and it could happen. You should be ready for these things. You're never ready for it. And you never have to get over the loss of a loved one, especially killed in the line of duty. We just have to learn how to manage it. And that's what I would say to the family, that, they are, that we're here for them. We will always be here for them. Rod Maloney, Local 4. All right, Rod, as for what's next in the investigation of the deputy shooting death, three teenagers in custody. One of those, Kareem Blakemore, who's 18, has been charged with lying to a peace officer during a violent crime investigation, also been charged with one count of resisting arrest. The others are being held, but on unrelated charges. They have not yet been charged in connection with Reckling's murder.